Let's break down Kogami's Buck 110. Kogami has a Buck 110, which is a folding knife that needs to be deployed with two hands. There is a new Buck 110, which is the automatic Buck 110. That problem about deployment is no longer an issue. Moreover, it opens up avenues of attack for Kogami. What do I mean by that? So one major issue I have with this scene is that Kogami essentially only does thrust. What I would have preferred is every time he did a failed thrust, he follow up with a slash. Because every time you have a failed thrust, there's a slash. And every time you have a failed slash, there's a thrust. He could have used it as a pick. If something comes in, he comes in with a slash, I pick at it. So I'm basically stabbing in and ripping out. Another option is a flick. I'm just tossing my weapon out like that. And I'm essentially cutting and scraping whatever I get. What is my ideal target? The eyes. So even if I don't get the eyes, I get the forehead. And if I get the forehead, I get blood in the eyes and it gives me what I want. My opponent is blinded. So. There are many aspects of the Buck 110 that Kogami could have utilized and did not. 